this is definitely going to be one of the stranger clothing try-ons I've ever done in my life. Even stranger than the time I raided Shaba's wardrobe. Hey Spuds, how's it going? I hope you're well and thank you for joining me on today's video. And, um, yeah, today I'm going to be trying on some men's festival wear that I found online. I thought it looked like fun. I am not taking the piss out of any of these clothes. I think if people want to wear them, that is fabulous. You do you. And to be honest, there's quite a lot of it that I'm like, I wish I had the guts to wear that out because I actually, in a strange way for me, because it's not normally in my taste, quite like some of it. But I'm just like, I, I would never personally wear it outside, I don't think. And I just, I really wanted to try some of it on and see what it actually looks like, not just on the like ripped muscular models where a see-through top would look fabulous. So what I did is I got a buttload of different festival items. I tried to put together some different outfit options. Not all of it was available in a size that is preferable to me, so some of it might be a bit big or a bit small, but we're just gonna go with it and have a bit of fun. And when I say a buttload, I do mean like a buttload. That did not look impressive. Unlike other clothing videos I've done in the past, I'm not gonna show you guys beforehand. I'm just gonna show you guys it on, when it's on my body. Yay, and probably looking terrible. And then we're gonna see it in comparison to the gorgeous models who wear it so much better than me. There is an awful lot of shininess. Hello there. We're all set up. I had the age old struggle of trying to get the framing at least semi okay for trying on clothes. I think this is all right. The images of the wonderful models are gonna come up here and then there's just gonna be twiggy old me standing here, you know, trying to look not completely ridiculous and failing probably. We're gonna start off nice and simple because not all of these things that I've put together as outfits were displayed as outfits. So I'm gonna have to like merge two together, but nice and simple, this washing machine net bag jumpsuit. This is what we're gonna be trying on first. Are we ready? Ta-da! Um, yeah, maybe, maybe if you hadn't guessed, this is one of the ones I had to buy in a bigger size because this had sold out in, in all but two sizes, I think. Yes, I, I genuinely feel like someone's gonna chuck me in the washing machine. Do you know what I'm talking about? Like those little net bags that you put in with your washing when you do, a, I don't know, I don't use them. I can't remember what they're used for, but some people use them and I feel like one of them right now. Also, because I felt like a festival outfit could not go without color and this is like the only one that's just white. I got some shoes. Do you like them? These these are genuinely like, I don't hate them. I don't hate them. It's weird. Yes, I'm trying them on with socks. What do we think of the shoes? Yes. This thing is surprisingly warm. Here, let me like come a bit closer so you can see the top half. It is like toasty in here. It's insulated. I thought it was going to be like completely see-through. It's like double mesh. Can you see my nipple? But yeah, this is this is the first Jamie Festival look. It is very comfortable. I don't hate it. It is slightly itchy though. Next. <laughs> oh look, it zips both ways. The next one is this combination of these wonderful gold and silver leggings and this silver top. So basically, I'm I'm just shiny, really shiny, like two different precious metals coming together on one body. Here is the second one. <laughs> Wow! I feel like I'm competing with the sun for which one of us is shiniest. I do! I don't mind the leggings! That's so much fun! Gold leg, silver leg, gold leg. <laughs> and this top is like rainbowy. This is amazing. Wow. The next outfit we have is these fabulous dungarees, which I have paired with a surprise because I did not buy a top to go underneath. So I'm literally just gonna be putting on a pair of dungarees. Are you ready for me to look like a pastel mint leaf? I think you are. I feel like a toddler. These are too big. This is just the dungarees for now. And the legs are very wide, very, very wide. The thing I paired it with was this wonderful sequined thing. I don't know what you do with it, but I'm putting it around my neck. Down is a rainbow, up is just silver. Ta-da! I thought I would like these more than I do. I very much dislike this, and I don't know if dungarees are my thing. This, this is, this is, this is not it, is it? No. That brings us on to the final outfit, which is this combination of gold shorts, which I love, with this kind of netty top, and again, an extra surprise for you on this one because I thought that wasn't out there enough. Wow. Look at that. The, 
The gems sit perfectly on the edge of my nipples. This is different. I don't hate it. I have not hated any of this. I thought that I would and I would feel really uncomfortable and everything. But this has actually been really fun. The one thing I would say, there is like a consistent theme across all of this clothing. It's itchy. This is tickling my nipples. It's not pleasant. <laughs> And to finish up on, a little bonus thing, which I think is my absolute favourite thing I bought. I don't know if I've said that about anything else yet, but if I did, I was lying because this is my favourite. Just give me a second to figure out how to put it on. Oh, cool. I thought it had sleeves. It does not have sleeves. Look. Oh my god. This is so cool. Wow. Anybody who would wear this to a place, like in public, not just on a camera. I mean, it feels daft because I wouldn't walk down the street. I wouldn't even go to a festival dressed like this. I wouldn't go anywhere dressed like this because that's just me. I'm just too self-conscious. But I will happily prance about in all of it on camera. I don't know why, what is the difference? But like kudos to people who go out in this stuff because it is fun, it's beautiful. And sometimes people end up looking a bit daft. Who cares? You do you. I feel like I could fly. Not gonna try it though. So yeah, that's all the outfit guys. I hope you enjoyed that. It was just a bit of fun and to say like wear whatever you want to wear. I've always wanted to try clothes that are really out there and I wanted to see what these would be like. They're a little bit too much for me to wear like out. I don't know if I'm going to keep any of it. I kind of liked some of it. I'm not going to lie. I did really enjoy trying them on, but I have come to several conclusions about festival wear. People want to look like one of three things or maybe a combination of all of them, but the first being a laundry mesh bag, as we discussed earlier, a second being a glitter ball, and a third being a rainbow. All of which are fantastic. Go for it. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know in the comments below. If you would like to see anything else like this, then please let me know. This was so much fun. It's really hot, though. This is very warm. I could not imagine wearing this, like, in the height of summer to a festival where the sun is just, like... <sighs> now, I'll see you next time. Much love. Bye!